Hi, I'm Nicole Kim, and I'm honored to be joining the College of Adaptive Arts as your new executive director. I grew up in New York City on the very northern tip of Manhattan in Inwood. My mother and older brother and I lived on the fifth floor. In our building, there was a man with Down syndrome who lived on our same floor. He was around 50 years old and lived with his mother. He rarely left their apartment, and as children, we were fascinated by him. The adults called him mongoloid, a term rooted in ignorance. We didn't know him as a person. He was just a mysterious figure with a disability. Because of this fear and ignorance, a perception was formed. Fast forward to my sophomore year at Brooklyn College, where I became interested in teaching. I applied for an internship at a nonprofit called Young Adult Institute. This organization serves people with intellectual and developmental disabilities. I worked with the adult population, and I have to say, I was initially very apprehensive because my only experience previous to that was with the mysterious man with Down syndrome. However, I quickly realized these adults were nothing like I had imagined. They worked, lived independently, they had relationships, they were funny, smart, and entirely capable. My director explained that having a disability doesn't mean you can't do anything. It's about islands of ability. Through my experiences connecting with these individuals with disabilities, my perceptions were transformed. Years later, when my oldest son was born, we discovered he had Down syndrome two months after his birth. At 21, I was a young mom, and after a day of mourning the child I thought I was going to have, I focused on loving the child right in front of me. Thanks to my experience in college, I knew my son, Saeed, would be okay. I knew I would raise him to be independent and capable and encourage him to do things to the best of his ability. Spoiler alert, I think I did. Seeing other adults with disabilities thriving in their lives showed me that my son's potential wasn't limited by his perceived disability. For the past 27 years, I've worked in the tech industry, learning best practices for running and scaling programs. I'm now ready to bring my knowledge to the nonprofit sector to help scale this organization. My life's journey connects me deeply to CAA's North Star, to empower the student body to creatively transform perceptions of individuals with disabilities. Over the past 15 years as a professor at CAA, I've witnessed how our educational platform transforms perceptions by showcasing our students' abilities and connecting them to the community. Our mission is to provide an equitable, accessible, and lifelong college program for adults with IDD wherever and whenever they need them. And I am deeply humbled to take on this role to elevate CAA to the next level. Thank you and I look forward to working with all of you.